All right, so we're into night two of the NFL draft. The Detroit Lions pick is in, but we're in the middle of commercial break right now. So we'll know who the pick is once we come back from commercials. So far in this draft, the Lions are not messing around. Like, they've usually phoned their picks in pretty quickly. Like, it's been very quick. Like, Brad Holmes and company are not messing around this draft so far. They're not wasting any time. So, yeah. So yeah, really on the Lions draft board, a lot of players still that the Lions could go with are still there. You have Terrence Marshall at receiver. You got Jeremiah Owasu Koma at linebacker. Even got Nick Bolton and Jabril Cox there. Like even Davon Nixon still there. Like Trevon Mohig, the safety out of TCU, is even still there. Like, there's a lot of good players still on the board. A lot of players, a couple of these players I thought would have gone in the first round. But now they here they are at 41. So the Lions got a lot of different options they can go here. They could go defense, but they could. I think they should address receiver real soon. Because, yeah, the Lions receiving core is really shot the shit. And I know the Lions did sign, you know, Tyrell Williams and, you know, Brashad Perriman and all that. But they're all on one-year deals. And the only one that's here on a long-term deal is Quintus Cephas on his rookie contract. So I think you need another long-term option of receiver. Um, I would say I would say probably Terrence Marshall here or even Jeremiah Wasu Karama would be the two picks that could help for sure make sense. So, yeah. It's going to be interesting what the Lions do at 41 to start a second round. And I do think the Lions are going to trade one of their third round picks tonight. I think they're going to trade down in the third round at some point. Because the Lions almost trade their third. Because three times in the last, uh, yeah, three times in the last four years, the Lions have traded their third round pick. The only time they didn't was 2018. Like 2017, they trade down and still got Galladay. 2019, they traded up to get Will Harris, and then last year, they traded the third round pick they got for the Terminatory Slay trade. They traded up to get Jonah Jackson. So, I think if the trend continues, if Brad Holmes wants to continue the trend, I'd say I think the Lions are going to trade a pick today, tonight. And I think it's probably going to be trade down in the third. Which pick they trade down with? I think it'll probably be the earlier pick. We'll have to see what the Lions do, though. At number. 41 and in the third. But yeah, the draft's back on. Well, it was back on. And of course, I got the Frank... Of course, I got the Frank Ragnow jersey on. Because Frank Ragnow is going to be announcing the picks. All the lines, day two picks. So we're going to see Frank Ragnow as long as he's not distracted from any fishing trips in Lake Erie. And the Giants traded down from 42. Damn. The Dolphins now on the clock. Hey, Cam, what... what was the most athletic cam though you know they say look good feel good feel good play good play good you get paid damn they're really What's taking a long time announcing the lions the pick that's the real question man I, I mean you see yeah. it so you know i'm taking all the way back to look the year back when i first got Jeez. i'm going back to you know act like i ain't got no money no more i'm coming back you didn't get any sacks rookie year though i thought you didn't get any sacks i didn't i didn't but see now i'm bringing i'm bringing i'm bringing the agility back and then I'm bringing the wisdom back of, of 11 years. What will the Lions do? So I'm bringing, I'm come on, come on, Ragdale. Stop fishing and get the pick in. Come on, get the pick in. Stop fishing. So there's all the Lions fans in attendance there. Oh, here we go. Here comes the Goodell. Oh, wait. I guess Frank now is not announcing it then. Let's see what it is. With the 41st pick in the 2021 NFL Draft, the Detroit Lions select Levi Onzerike, defensive tackle, Washington. Oh, Levi! Out of Washington, Levi Onzerike. That's a bit of a tongue twister name. I had a feeling he was going to be mocked to the Lions in the second round. I saw a couple mocks of it. All right. So the Lions get a defensive tackle to stuff the middle. So we get some, we get another defensive tackle for the long run to pair well with uh, Michael Brockers and John Penasini. This is a player I was pretty high on for sure. 
I really like the pick, man. Yeah, he def. I think he definitely can be a playmaker. I really like the pick, man. Getting defensive tackle right here. I dig it. I think you need to address defense, but I guess you know maybe see what happens in receiver later on. I mean the lines. I mean the receiver class is very deep, and there's a lot of playmakers later on. You know, see what there is. But yeah, that's a solid pickup for sure. So, so far, both of the Lions picks have been from college schools out west. You had Oregon and now Washington. So, yeah, that's not a bad pick. Levi's not a bad pick. I can dig it. So, so far, the first two picks have been addressing the trenches. He addressed the offensive side has been addressed, and now the defensive side of the trenches have been addressed. Not bad. So, yeah, I guess I'll be back later on for the next pick. Peace.